Hey guys, what's up? It's Andy Elliott. Today is going to be how to build confidence as a car salesman. Woo! This is the video that could change your life. I'm going to tell you something, right? What I'm going to talk to you about today is probably the realest conversation that anyone could ever have in sales, okay? Your confidence is everything. And I'm going to explain something to you, right? Competence creates confidence. So, if you're watching this video right now and you don't know who I am, my name is Andy Elliott. I made over 700 grand in selling cars. I'm going to kind of speed through this. My goal is I'm not just a trainer. I was a person that was the guinea pig. I did it on my own, and now I teach you exactly how you can go do it. We train over 100,000 salespeople across the country, we're all across the world. We're killing it. We're crushing it. We'd love for you to be a part of our group. Guys, subscribe if you haven't to my channel. Like the video. Shoot me a comment. Like I said, I got your back for life. So let's talk about this. How to build massive confidence as a car salesman. Well, number one, I'd like you to do this. You always will see me, I'll have a whiteboard and I'll have a marker, okay? Because I love writing stuff down. I always say this, 90% of what you write, you'll retain. If you don't write stuff down, your life ain't gonna change, okay? You hear me say something, you're like, man, that resonates with me. I say something else, you're like, man, that resonates with me. And then all of a sudden, you forgot the first thing, okay? Write stuff down, grab pen and paper, let's rock and roll. I care about you elevating your life. All right, so, and by the way, as I start to go over these little topics with you right here on how to create massive confidence, I wanna say this to you. Being fired up every day is something that's your responsibility as a salesperson. I got something over here I want to tell you about, but I'm going to talk about step one real quick, and then I'm going to go into this. Being driven versus motivated, okay? Motivated means this. Hey, I watched the YouTube video, listened to my favorite song, I'm motivated, I got jacked up. Hey, life's good, right? I got money in the bank. You know what I'm saying? I'm motivated, okay? I'm fired up. Hey, I just, I just sold three cars. I'm jacked up. Well, what happens, right, is motivation is a feeling. And if you're relying on that motivated feeling to do well in sales, you're gonna get your clock clean, okay? You have to stop being, mo I'm not saying stop being motivated, but relying on the, on the motivation feeling, and you have to become driven. Let me explain to you what driven looks like, okay? And this is important, okay? How you wake up when the sun isn't shining, okay? When you just lost your best customer. You just lost your best customer. Okay? You know, customers said they're going to come right back, right? And guess what? They didn't ever come back? That guy, right? Maybe you guys bought off you five times. And guess what happens? Now he bought across the street. Your butt hurt about it. Okay? You got problems going on at home. You don't have any money in the bank. Okay? How you wake up on that day is how you'll wake up every day. My point is, you have to be driven, okay? I wake up, I got a headache, I don't feel like it, my stomach hurts, I feel sick, guess what happens? I'm driven. I get out of bed, I'm like, boom, man, I know my why, I wanna become one of the top salespeople in the country, it's time to go, baby, rock and roll, flags are flying, people are buying, guess what? I'm gonna create my own future, I know what my future looks like by the way I created it today. Today's a beautiful day, I'm gonna go attack it, I'm gonna kill it, and anything that you keep attacking on, guess what? It will break. You will figure out how to make today an amazing day. I don't have to be motivated. I don't have to feel motivated to make that happen. So, in order to build massive confidence, you have to have a great attitude, right? Which is going to be my next thing I'm going to talk about in a second. You got to have a great attitude, but you got to decide to be driven and not motivated, okay? I watch YouTube videos too all the time. I like to get motivated. I like to get fired up, but I am driven. You take it all away, get all all the noise out of my life, everything, okay? I don't care what happens, whether the sun doesn't come up or not, I am driven. Steal this from me. Please, take it from me right now. Put that in your life, you'll crush everybody. Guys, every morning, I want to say this, at 7 a.m. Central Standard Time, okay? I've got a cell phone, people send me text messages on all the time, okay? But what I wanted to do, I wanted to have a way to reach out to all the salespeople across the country, not just on Facebook, right? We got Andy Elliott Car Sales Nation on Facebook. That's our group. You can join us. It's amazing. But I wanted to be able to shoot a text every morning and be able to send out a motivational video, maybe just you know 30 to 60 seconds, something fired up, right? Something to get you jacked up for the day and ready to crush it and kill it, right? If you don't tell yourself how the day is going to go, someone else will. So I created this text community. It's amazing. All across the country, everybody's opting into this text community. So every morning at 7 a.m., 
All you have to do, I want you to join my text community, do it right now. Type in 480, right, 480. Uh, 470 1968. You see this phone number? It looks like a phone number. You can't call it. You can call it. It'll say, hey, this is Andy. Shoot me a text. Okay? It's a text community. All around the world, every morning at 7 a.m. Central Standard Time, I will send out a text message to you. Okay? And most 99% of the time, it's a video of me that I shoot every morning, getting you jacked up, fired up for the day. I'd like for you to join me there. All you have to do is text this number right now for daily motivation. Once you text it, It'll, it'll hit you with a little response. It'll say, hey, add to contacts. Type in Andy Daily Text Motivation, okay? Save the contact. Guess what? Every single morning, 7 a.m., you get it. When you're getting in your car, press play, and I promise you, I will push you to that next level, and we'll crush it and kill it. Free training, you know, motivation, everything. So how to have massive confidence? Guess what? Stay in front of people that have been where you want to go, and I'll tell you how to do it, all right? So let's get into this. So secondly, we talked about driven versus motivated. Motivated, cross out being motivated. I want you to get motivated, but I want you to live in the stage of being driven. That's the mindset. We're driven. We're unbreakable. Nobody wants to stand in front of a tsunami, right? If a tsunami hits a beach, if you're on it, you're toast. That's us, guys. We're crushing everybody. All right. Fearless, bulletproof confidence. If you want to have confidence, you've got to get fear out of your life, okay? You can't fear anything anymore. And you know what that means? You have to stop caring what people think about you, okay? In order to level up as a salesperson and you're trying to have massive confidence, a lot of the times you're probably trying to please other salespeople around you to try to seem like you're great at what you do. Forget them. Guys, quit trying to please people. If you, if you, if you care what other people think about you, you'll become the world's biggest punk, okay? Do not care what other people think about you. So, in order to have fear, right, you're never going to have confidence. Confidence. So you have to have fearless, bulletproof confidence. With that being said, right, confidence comes from competence, okay? Which means you have to be really fired up and believe in yourself that you're good at your job. And guess what? The better you get at your job, the higher that the confidence rises, okay? It's kind of like, look, skill, let's say there's a skill meter here, and then you got confidence. As this increases, this increases. It's really hard to increase your confidence if you're not going to increase your skill, okay? Which, if you need help, remember, you can always set up a strategy call with me, okay? On the YouTube link below, you can click on it. Guys, it's free. It doesn't cost anything. You click on it, set up a strategy call with me. I'll help you go to the next level. I'll help you figure out kind of where, I always say, the difference between where you are and where you're going is the gap in your skill set. Fix the skill, it'll fix the confidence, I promise you. And that will help you scale to your next level. So it's not about who you are, it's about who you're becoming. We want to increase the skill, that'll increase the confidence, okay? So this right here, confidence in the skill that you have is important. That's how you need to be extremely confident is by believing in yourself, all right? So challenge yourself on all of your weaknesses. Right now, I want you to think about something. If you really want to push yourself to the next level, your goal is to eliminate any whole Holes that you have in your sales game, okay? Because that will make you believe in yourself more, which hint is like the most important thing as a salesperson is to believe in yourself. Because in order to have confidence, you have to believe in yourself. And guess what? If you believe in yourself, your customers will believe in you, all right? So take this bucket right here. This is a bucket. I'm pouring water into the bucket. If there's holes in this bucket, the water will pour out, which I call like success. That's success. I'm pouring success into the bucket. That's what I'm doing with you right now. You're identifying your holes, okay? Do the mirror test. Don't lie to yourself. This right here, these are your holes. Guess what happens? You see a hole right here? You say, hey, Andy, you know what? I have been relying on a feeling of being motivated to make it, and you just told me that being driven is what I need to do. So even if I'm having the worst day of my life, I'm still gonna be driven. Nothing's gonna stop me again. And guess what, I still want that feeling of being motivated, but even if it's absence and it's not there, I'm still gonna crush it and kill it, and I'm no longer gonna walk around the dealership and say, oh man, I just don't feel like I'm motivated today. So guess what happens? You fix that hole, guess what? No more success goes out of it. So as we start to patch all the holes in your game, guess what? You challenge all your weaknesses. Look, the, and understand this, the more you walk away from accountability, the weaker you will become. 
Okay? The more you walk away from accountability, the weaker you will become. Never, ever forget that, okay? So, challenge yourself. Every man and every woman should test themselves every day. Look at yourself in the mirror and say, hey, I, hey I, I'm not going to lie to myself, all right? These are my weaknesses. This is what I need to fix. Fix it. All right. Now, how to build crazy high confidence is really going to come in this next little section right here, okay? This is obviously matching your skill, being driven, okay? The power of a positive attitude. I said video here. Crazy. Attitude. Power of a positive attitude. Listen, guys, if, you're don't, if you don't have a great attitude, nothing else matters, okay? People got problems going on at home, okay? They got problems going on at home. They come into the dealership. They deserve to meet somebody who's motivated, who's fired up, who's like a mentor. I'm not asking you to be people's mentor, but who's a mentor, who's loving, who's kind, who's going to give them a world-class customer service. Guess what happens? That won't happen, and you can't play at it. 10 on that attitude, guess what? If you don't carry that on the forefront of your mind, I have to protect my attitude at all times. Listen, if I don't tell myself how my day is going to go first thing in the morning, text the community number, we'll help you there, okay? I'll send you that daily motivation. Someone, you're going to leave the door, go into the dealership, manager's going to say, hey, go park those cars on the front line, man. Who left these deals over here? Hey, you know what? And you're like, uh, and guess what happens? Your day's lost. Okay? I tell myself how my day is going to go, and I promise you, no one can stop me. So number one, power of a positive attitude. Keep that at your forefront. you got to stay fired up. It's got to be at a 10. One to 10, it's got to be a 10, okay? Guess what? If you don't own your mind, if you don't own your headspace, someone else will. Own your positive attitude headspace. Don't you ever let anybody break that, okay? No matter what. You're dead, broke, E on zero. You don't have anything. Have a great attitude, all right? I promise you, you'll work your way out of it, all right? Okay. Upbeat at all all times. Upbeat at all times, guys. Look, I got it. I don't care if you're an introvert or an extrovert. Crank up the energy. Listen, if you want to have massive confidence, look, put on a show worth paying for. You're in the era of the worst salesperson in the history of time. So how hard right now would it be for you to be great? Not very hard, but your show has to be worth, worth paying for. Guess what? Crank it up. Be upbeat at all times. Right now, rate yourself. One to ten. How do I rate my level of my upbeat? Walk to your managers right now and say, guys, hey, one to ten, how do you rate me on, on like am I upbeat? Am I am I in the middle? Am I, you know, am I kind of like you know really soft spoken? How am I? One to ten. Guess what? If they're not saying a 10, go back to the bucket we talked about. Elevate how upbeat you are in your attitude, okay? Look, motivated, be motivated, okay? Which means daily, watch motivational stuff. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Watch the training every day. I don't talk about sales training in general. I talk about automotive sales training, which yes, could work in every area of sales, but specifically the automotive sales pro can learn everything from me. Exactly how I made 700 grand a year selling cars. I teach it to you, okay? So with that being said, stay on your A game. I didn't say your B, your C, or your D game, your A game. God made you to be great. Go be great, crush the day, and kill it. Look, three words, raise your standards, okay? Raise your standards. You got a glass ceiling over your head? Shatter it. You think you can only make 100 grand? Guess what? Man, dude, you can make 100 grand in two months. But you have to raise your standards and you would have to play on your A game. I need that upbeat attitude, right? I need that fired up mindset, fired up attitude. And like I said, we got to increase your energy at all times. Right here, set your sights high. If you want to have great confidence, I'm going to tell you this. You can't be a small thinker. Small thinkers don't have great confidence, okay? A lot of people underestimate the amount, right, of like energy and, and like what should go in to setting your sights. Setting your sights is physically you telling yourself, hey man, I am going to raise my standards, I am going to raise the target, and guess what happens? I am not going to miss it. Matter of fact, I'm not even going to hit that target. I'm going to freaking murder it, okay? That right there, setting, setting your sights, will increase you to automatically level up your confidence they always say that term, fake it till you make it. I don't know if you ever heard of that. But basically, you're faking it, right? You're not there. You're not a millionaire there yet, but you're going there, okay? You're going there. Yeah, you ain't got any money in the bank. You're still going to be a millionaire, okay? You got to believe 
So you have to raise your sights, you raise your standards, you raise your confidence to match those massive goals. I promise you, the law of attraction will start working and you'll become a more confident, driven person and you will start to elevate up into those higher deals. I always say, go to deeper waters and play with bigger fish. You're training with me, I got you, I promise you. I always say, show me your trainer, I'll show you your future, I promise you. You hang around me enough, I'm gonna change your life, okay? I'm your circle. I'll help you. As a man thinketh. This was a little book. It probably takes 20 minutes to read. It's called As a Man Thinketh. I would highly recommend reading it. It means this. If you believe you can, you're right. Visualization is very important, okay? When I had nothing, when I had nothing, I was dead broken on E. I mean, literally nothing. I visualized myself breaking the world record of most money made in a year. I really did. I didn't want to be the best salesperson in my store, not the best in the state. I want to be the best in the country. I didn't want to sell the most cars, okay? My goal was to deposit the most money made. That was my goal, and I knew I could do it, okay? I had a GM one time. I was going to cash my check, and he was like, hey, Andy, why don't you, we, work, we, we banked at the same bank. I was, I was maybe 19, 20 years old. He said, Andy, hey, take my check, right? And we'd you go to deposit in the bank when you, when you put yours in? I was really cool with him. I got his lunch every day. I said, sure, man, why not? I go to deposit my check, a little baby check, and I go to deposit his, and I said, hey, also, my, my, uh, one of the guys I works with, he banks here, he wanted me to deposit his check as well. It was a $48,000 take home check, 48,000. And I realized, I said, hey man, you know what? I think that guy's not Superman. I think that I actually have been built and born and everything that I've eaten, that this shit sandwich I've gone through in life has been practiced to get me ready for what I'm about to go through now. I bet I could become better than that guy. Now, I would have to be extremely skilled, okay? And I would have to start thinking bigger immediately, and I would have to do all the things that I just talked to you about. But as a man thinketh, I, I envisioned and I visualized. Visualization is everything. I envisualized myself taking that $48,000 take home check, me, myself, and putting that in the bank. And you know what happened? I was like a lion chasing a gazelle. I was on a hunt. I, w I didn't want to eat the gazelle. I wanted to hunt the gazelle. I became addicted to the hunt. And guess what happened? As I started to hunt, and as I visualized myself, even before it happened, it manifested in me that I was going to become one of the top salespeople in the country. And if I ever missed a deal, I was going to dissect why I missed it so I could become the best. I wanted to be able to close, and I wanted to be like Alcatraz. See this on my wrist? It says Alcatraz. No one escapes, okay? I wanted to literally be able to close anything. If It's like a receiver in the NFL. If they can touch the football, they can catch it. Guess what happens? Even if it brushed my finger, I want to be able to touch that football. If I could touch it, I could catch it. And I even thought, even if I couldn't touch it, I could catch it. Guess what that means? If I had 10 customers in front of me, I believe that they came to buy, they're gonna buy and they will buy as long as I do my job. And guess what? I sold everybody. I started closing at 80% closing ratio, where the average closed at 30%. You know what? I couldn't stomach being average anymore. It made me sick. Because I changed the way that I think, it started to automatically change my confidence. Okay, And I want you to steal this from me and take this from me. I'm teaching you this because it's extremely important to you. Okay, Now, as a man thinketh, which means change the way you think. Look, you change, you change your mindset, you'll change your money. You change your mindset, you'll change your money. That is that right there. And that's you. You're the only person that's responsible. As you go look in the mirror right now, you know the only person responsible for you being extremely successful or not being successful is you. You can hurt yourself and tear yourself down, or you can build yourself up and make and recreate yourself today by watching this video. And by the way, you can watch this video a thousand times, okay? Watch it, write it down, take notes, everything that I'm saying, recreate yourself, become a brand new person, right? Don't work on the old, build the new, okay? Don't work on the old, build the new. Guys, become a master communicator, all right? This is the last thing. If you want to have confidence, right, and you want to be able to sell anybody, anytime, anyplace, anywhere, on the phone, in person, and it doesn't matter. You have to be great at communicating with people, okay? Make it easy. Say, Andy, wh what is a master communicator? It's a person that can make it easy to say yes to. Write this down. A master communicator is somebody who can make it easy to say yes to, hard to say no to, and they can make it the customer's idea every single time. If you can do that, that is the unfair advantage, and I can teach you 
actually how to do that. Okay? You guys want to set up a strategy call with me? Click on the link below, set it up. It'll be me and you, and I will tell you exactly how to dominate it and become a master communicator. I do it all time, like I said, with hundreds of thousands of salespeople all around the country. And as I fly out every week and I train dealerships all across the nation, I want to tell you something, right? This is something that when I teach this to salespeople, man, it changes everything for them. But one of the beautiful things that it changes is this confidence. Guys, this is a video about how you can be more confident, about how you can be more confident as a car salesman. Even if you're watching this video and you don't even sell cars, but you're in sales or your mother, father, you know, it doesn't matter. Like being confident in life and everything, you could have taken apply this to everything, but I want to apply this to my automotive sales pros out there, my managers and my GMs and my salespeople that want to go to the next level, kill it and crush it. So guys, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Hey, by the way, send this video to a couple of your friends. Share it. Share the love, guys. Help me. Give me a thumbs up on it. Send me a comment below if you liked it. Let me know. I love you guys. Crush it. Have an amazing day. I'll talk to you guys soon.